Good morning, good morning. It's see here with 307 Junk Journals. I am here to make another, well, to start another St. Patty's Day journal. This one is going to be a tag journal. I've done a little prep. Um, this is, so this is going to be a little different than your standard tag journal. And as you can see, there's lots of pages in here. Lots and lots. And I'm using Amy over at Craft Cats kit primarily. Um, so, and it's a fabulous kit. It's called Wearing of the Green. And if you haven't gotten it, well, you should go get it. Okay, so I'm just clipping these, these corners off. Oh, my little dog moved. Okay, so all that I'm going to do now, and there will probably be a bit of trimming because see if that isn't lining up up there. Well, I think it's lining up. It's not lining up down here. Um, okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the three and then the two, and I'm going to alternate them. So let me get my fabric pack down. And I'm just and I'm just going to cut these I don't know an inch an inch and a half long. I'm really just kind of oops guessing how many is it? That's three, so then I need two. So we'll do a couple of these. And then we'll, then I'll show you the, what, um, there's actually going to be a cover for this. So, a hard cover. And yet here I am still cutting. This is what one has to do. And like I said, I'm just kind of guesstimating. There's no mathematics to my... Okay, so that's that's all that we're, I'm going to do right now. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put three down. Ooh, that's gross. That's a tad bit good brain. Now my little dog is as tight as she wants to go outside. Well, of course she does. Why? Because she's just that way. Oh, no. Good gosh. Good golly, Miss Molly. Maggie, no. Okay, so I'm going to put a daub here, a daub in the center, and a daub down here. Okay, and then I'm going to put this one there, and then this one here. And I know that, like, this one here has some bleed through. I'm not too concerned about it because, well, I'm just not. Okay, so now what we need to do is we need to, and I'm just going to take some art glitter glue here. I may have to pause you. Which is really going to, because I'm pretty sure she didn't have to go outside. I think she's just being a pill. But she is old. So one never knows. Okay, and then I'm just going to line that up like that and like that. Right there. Oops, and then push it over here. Oops, and then I pushed it down too far. Okay, we might use our glitter glue for this. I don't know. Because our glitter glue, well, it adheres rather quickly. There. There. 
well, and I still didn't get it all. Okay, so I'm going to use a combination of art glitter glue. You know, I don't know that it really matters. Art glitter glue does glue fabric. And I have it out, so... And we're going to use the little leprechaun here for as our first page. What not to do? I think I got all the oops. No. See, this first one is going to be special because I might be off camera. Sorry. Because I didn't use the art glitter glue and I don't think I put enough glue on. Okay, so now that now what you do is you turn this over like so, and you turn this over like so. Okay, I'm gonna put you on hold and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I got ink on my hand, it's on the top of my hand somehow. Not sure how that happened. Now, the ink on my fingers, I completely know where that came from. Anyway, okay, so I'm going to line this piece of, let me spit on everything, this piece of, um, yeah, music paper here. I'm just going to take some art glitter glue here and just put a squidge there and then take this and put it in between. Like so, maybe. Yes. Okay, and then I am gonna put those up over there. You know, I should ink these, but eh. Okay, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the arch glitter glue and glue really well around everything here. Especially around the fabric. And I should take this tip off if I can. Yes, I can. Because, you see, more glue will come out. And that is a fabulous thing. Okay, and then I'm going to, oops, I probably should put some glue here on that fabric and then we're going to fold this over and I don't think I oops Ooh. well it'll be fine you won't see it so glue and ink okay so there is that one Okay, so now you put these two to get back together like so and you grab your next page and you line them up like so maybe okay i'm going to what i'm going to do because i think it might make my life a little bit easier yeah. Because y'all know I need all the help I can get. Oops. Is I am going to clip the top and clip the bottom. There we go. And then I'm just going to take some glue here and some glue. Oops. Down there. And I squidged it. And you don't want it too tight. Okay, there. And I forgot to switch in the middle. There. Oops. And then you want those out. And then we're just going to 
take our art glitter glue. I'm glad I took that fine tip off. Okay, maybe I am because now it's oops. Oh no, now it's clogged. My little white dog is outside barking her little head off. Rude, I tell you, rude. Okay, then we're gonna take, we're gonna try to take this and just fold it over like so, and then see. We have, ta-da! And then we'll take our next page. Oh, God bless America, did I do this wrong? No, I did not. So this next page here will have three, and you're going to be able to see, to see this, to see the, um, on on the paper here and again I'm okay with that if you're not then you would need to do a page somewhere to the last page but you see this one here okay there okay Cut the those off. There. Okay, and then I'm going to lay this one right here. Oops. We're gonna do this. And we're going to put some clips on. Okay, that clip is stuck. And then, oops, that's not what happened here. That is not where it should be. That is where that one. And this one has folded under. There. You just want to make sure everything is, you know, lined up. Okay, so now that now we have, now we need to do this double. So there's that one, and then there's that one, and again, you don't want to make these ultra tight. Okay, and then, okay, we're going to take the clips off, and then we're going to, squidge the glue all over. we need to put the back on this tag. Right. Like that. There. Oh dear. No, oh, I got glue everywhere. Everywhere. It's coming out. Everywhere. Uh oh, what happened here? Did that get, where did that go? Okay, there it is. I will probably have to go back in and glue, like, some of these double ones together. Oops. Um, that didn't. Oops. That one's trying to come out. But see, that is how you do... Start with three, and then you go with two, and then you do three, and then you do two, and okay. Excuse me. We'll go until I finish. These. Oh, and I'm missing one. It's okay. Okay, so the 
here's that one. And then there's this one. Okay. And then we're going to, I'm just going to, well, we're just going to do this. Right? Is that right? Yes, I believe it is. This does get a tad bit confusing, I'm telling you. And if you're confused, it's completely normal. Okay, so. Uh -huh. No. Okay, so I want to do that. Pull that off. Because I need a wet one. Okay, and then we'll put this one back here, and we'll grab the next one. I think this will just go like this, yes. And then, okay, let's add the clips because, well, God bless America. Again, I need all the help I can get. Okay, so there's that. And then this is the three one, so we want right there, right there, and right there. And this isn't where it's supposed to be. There. Okay, then we'll bring that one up here. And we'll bring this one up here. And then we'll bring this one up here. Okay, and then we'll unclamp them. Again, like I said, I need all the help I can get. Take my articulature glue and just glue everywhere. Okay, so there. And then you fold this one over. Let me give it a squish. Is that why? Why is that not? Because I didn't put any glue there. That's why. Okay. There. And then you see, see, we're getting our spine there. Okay, so now this next one, is a shiny paper, and this is a 3-1, and I made these 3 by 6 the ones that are just folded paper are, or no, they're 5, sorry, 5 by 6 right, 5, 5 and a half, by six. Okay, now that I need what, one more of these ones cut. It's fine because I got, I stripped a bunch last night. So we would have, yes, I did hit record again. Okay, and I'm just going to cut one more because that's all we're going to do. And then I'll show you it's going to be pretty short video today which there's nothing wrong with short videos right okay, that one goes up there this one comes here and this one wow this one's a long one well we'll just put it right there Make sure it's all glued down. Take the clips out. And then spread a bunch of glue inside here. Oops. Right 
there. Oh, my God. I got squidge. Some glue squidged out. It's fine. I got glue all over my fingers. All over. Okay, so then this one's going to go back here. And we're going to put that double one on. Oops, this needs. The angle punch. Uh, these line up pretty well. Yeah, pretty well. Okay, so now this one goes down here. And I'm going to clip it. Oops. Because again, I need all that. Oops, sorry. I need all the help I can get. Okay, now we're just going to do the double here. Bring that over. Bring that one over. Make sure everything is all nice and glued down. And then take man I am definitely using my wet, my wet one today okay, we're going to take that off put that right there put a bunch of glue down and if you don't want to use your art glitter glue, you could use um, Elmer's glue. You could use PVA glue. You could use your um, there. you could use your fabric tack like I did in the beginning. Oops, I don't know. Okay, there we go. But yeah, this is, she's, it's going to be fairly chunky. Okay, so the next one we would have two. So this page would go here and we would do two and then close it. And then we would bring this one in, put that one there, then bring these three over like that. And close it, and then we would bring this one in, and yeah, so skippy skippy. And then see, there's the how this binding is going to go together. I will probably come back and clip these, eh, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I'll probably clip the outside ones. I don't know that I'll clip the inside ones, but I might. We don't know. So what I did for the cover, um, we are going to have a cover for this. I did it in the Midori set. I had this little narrow book, and I put some fabric on it, and it had a fabric or fabric-like cover to it. Um, and I wanted some of that to show, obviously. I put some green polka dot fabric that I got from my bestie. Which is fabulous because it goes really good with this journal. And then I put some lace and some garments because we did the Midori style. This is from Amy's, um, wearing of the green kit and so is this and like I said all the tags in here are also from her wearing of the green and I'll go through that more with you when everything is done and then what I'm just going to do is slide that in like that and see it'll be like that be fabulous and I'll probably put some pockets I know that this is a lot wider but I'm not, I'm fine with that. Um, I think it just adds a little bit more character because I can come in, put some laces, put some big laces in there if I wanted. Um, that's not a big lace. 
But, you know, laces like this I could put in there and have it hanging over. I don't know. Sky's the limit. So, I will finish this off camera and then next week we will we'll start decorating. I'm probably going to do this one, the majority of it off camera. But we will see. Yes. So, and then, so on Friday, we're going to be working in this little journal. The St. Patty's Day journal, which has a lot of Amy's papers in it as well. And this one here is like a loose, loose leaf one. See, I haven't actually sewed the signature, so you could take out the papers if you so desired. And Yeah, but that will be working in that one, doing some decorating. All right, so, oh, and the camera cut, I hope I was on camera, because, goodness, it got, it got schmucked. Okay, all right, well, I'm going to continue working on this out, off camera, oh no, there it is, <laughs> I lost the little fine tip for this, and I will see you tomorrow for the 50 stack challenge which is, if you want to craft along with me, um, number 17 is, number 17, what is number 17? One is the golden book, or a little golden book, and the other one, I can't remember, she did a frog, just some frogs from a little golden book. And I can't remember what the other one was. But you'll see um, tomorrow what that is. Like I said, the first prompt is little golden book. So if you want to um, craft along with me. It, that And that means you can use... Um, I had glue everywhere. You can use... A, a page out of a little golden book. You can use a page out of a children's book. It doesn't matter. Whatever little golden book reminds you of. If it reminds you of a little golden book, um, then make a gold book. Booklet or something. Um, but yes, it's whatever it reminds you of. I think that's where I got this one from. It's from a little golden book. I don't know. Maybe I'll fold it in half and make a tag out of it or something. I don't know. But we will see you tomorrow for the 50 stack challenge. And then on Friday, we'll be working in some more St. Patty's Day. All right. We'll see you tomorrow. You have a wonderful day. Okay. Bye.